In this video, I'd like to demonstrate how you can customize six of the most commonly used tools and their properties to suit each template. Embroidery Studio 4.2 has default values for each tool preset. Notice, as I select a tool, the property changes. Column A and column B default to satin stitch. Column C to a satin outline. Complex fill and complex turning default to tatami. And lettering defaults to block 2 on a free line. All of these settings can be changed in your template to suit the most common use for each tool. For example, my current settings in the normal template for column A are fill spacing of 0.4 of a millimeter. My preference for this template is to use auto spacing adjusted to 90%, and underlay for most applications, a center run is sufficient. Change the settings and choose Save from the bottom of the property box. Then select Preset Object Style and from the drop down, the tool whose settings you wish to change. Open a new work area and notice the changes have been affected. For complex fill objects, I like an offset fraction of 0.33.33, a stitch angle of 23 degrees, and a single tatami underlay running at 90 degrees to the top stitching with a second edge run underlay, with a margin setting of 0.2 of a millimeter. Notice I do not have to select the object, just change the settings and save to the template. The six tools you can make these customizations to are lettering, column A, column B, column C, complex fill and complex turning. To customize these tools in a different template, first open a new template design using the template you wish to make the changes to. 